Hey guys, it's Aaron. I want to run through templates today. I know some people just see templates as that little thing you check when you install a new version and then is how your model starts each time. But I want to run through a couple things, show you a couple templates that maybe you haven't used before and uh, might help you out in your SketchUping. So let's hop right in. To start a new model on a new template, if I go to just file new, I'm gonna get the standard new template, and this is my default template right here. If I wanna choose what template I wanna use, I'm gonna go up to file, and rather than hit new, hit new from template. And that's gonna bring up the default templates. A lot of people have seen these ones. They know that uh, you know they have the simple, architectural, uh, landscape, that kind of thing. What a lot of people don't know is this, this is actually a lot bigger than just what you can see here. You actually see there's, there's actually quite a few additional templates if you open this up all the way. So what I wanna look at now is some of these additional templates down towards the bottom that you could actually use for some different modeling situations. So let's hop in and take a look at the few of those right now. The first one I want to look at, we call SketchUp at Night. And this is our answer to the request for a dark mode. You can see that uh, this is perfect. This uh, takes a strain off the eyes. If it's in the evening, you want to keep modeling without that bright glaring light, this is a great way to do it. So there's Mark, change his outfit, all dressed in black, a little bit easier to see. And the, uh, the default face style is also black on the outside. So um, if you are looking for that dark mode, this is a great solution for you because it will keep everything Nice and dark. SketchUp at night. If SketchUp at night is a little too monotone and dark for you, we have something on the other end of the spectrum, pun intended, with Rainbow Land. Rainbow Land gives you all the colors of the rainbow and keeps you constantly knowing that you're in a bright, colorful, happy place. Rainbow Land. If you've ever been zooming around in SketchUp and lost track of your axes, know that you're not alone and know that you can now use the Max Axes template. This will give you a very big, very difficult to lose Axes instead of that skinny little one that gets off in the background and you lose track of. Max Axes, check that out. And finally, a template we like to call the Bird Box Challenge. This is your opportunity to take on the Bird Box Challenge in a way that is safe. You can see the mark is back there, stuff is going on in here, but I can't quite see it because the blindfold covers up most of the viewing area. So there's a look at a few of our expanded templates in SketchUp 2019. If for whatever reason you go into your templates and you don't see those when you scroll down, head up to 3D Warehouse and you can download them from there. There are just some new options, some nice options that uh, give you some different ways to design while you're inside of SketchUp. So hopefully that helped. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Leave us a comment if so. And most of all, have a great April 1st. Thank you.